surrender immediately. I will promise you there will be no bloodshed, no looting, no ill treatment for your people. Surrender is not an option. So this episode is where all of Kalia's hopes and dreams get checked by reality. In this episode, Kalia will be pushed to the extreme. You'll see her at her most vulnerable. You'll see her at her most uh, terrified and scared. And you'll see her at her angriest as well. You are not supposed to be running around! Please, wait, alright? Just wait! In this episode, we see a very deep side of Chi. We see her honor and her loyalty. For Chi, because she has survived, she's built her empire. And she's never really trusted Adnan or his consort, Lina. So there's always at the back of Chi's mind that something's going on. You know, something's going on. I don't know what it is, but I'm gonna I'm gonna send out fillers. Jambu is easily swayed to join that side for his own best interest, you know, and then they square down. Our heroine for the series goes into the enemy's lair and um, the question is like will she survive? From what I've heard, your position has shifted quite a bit. I know Dan is dead. Episode 6 actually starts with a voiceover from DeWitt. So for the very first time, we see another side of him, a softer side. Everyone here has loss. He has a loss too. This is a move that disillusions her from uh, the rest of the stakeholders in, uh, in Grise. And this puts Grise actually in a very dangerous spot because temporarily without a leader, Adnan is able to seize power. Are you so foolish? I will not trust you any more than Dewey. She is one woman that believes in her sixth sense. That's how she survived in the first place. Honor and justice, right? The samurai code. You have Ryuchi, who develops a consciousness of right and wrong. Ryuichi thinks Tanaka did not have mercy. So I think that's the biggest conflict. For Tanaka, he's seen his own kin being totally disobedient. So you do not deserve to be samurai. So that's kind of the mindset when they meet again. And they, they have this sort of like hatred for each other. What happened? Kalia returns to Grise to find that she has lost the town. This is the lowest point of Kalia. Maran? The thing that really hurt her was not really Adnan taking over the town, but rather Maran uh, betraying her. 